Hey everyone, welcome back to TechWoo. In this video, we'll explore 8 hidden settings and experimental features in the Google Chrome Flags menu that many users may not be aware of. You can access these flags through the URL as shown on the screen. These flags constantly evolve and will provide an overview of some of the most interesting hidden Chrome options worth considering. First, let's discuss parallel downloading. Now, you might be wondering what parallel downloading is, it's a nifty feature that can significantly increase your download speeds. Imagine you're downloading a large file. Instead of downloading it in one go, parallel downloading splits it into separate parts and downloads them simultaneously. This means you can get your files much faster. To enable it, simply click on default and select enabled. Now, just test it by downloading a file when it's enabled and feel the difference. From what I've read, it creates three parallel connections, which helps to improve the speed. Before moving on to our next setting, hit that like button, subscribe to TechWoop, and turn on notifications for more Chrome tips and tricks. Let's go through our next hidden Chrome setting. Smooth scrolling. You might not even realize it, but Google Chrome already has smooth scrolling enabled by default. It's subtle, unlike the super delayed smooth scrolling you might find in other browsers, and it doesn't bother me personally. However, if you're curious, you can disable it. You may notice a difference and even prefer browsing without smooth scrolling. It can feel more responsive, making it easier to scroll through pages faster. The downside is that it might not look as soft, so it's about what you prefer. Moving on to another hidden setting in Google Chrome, we have the Tab Audio Muting UI Control. This one's a favorite of mine, and I can't think of any reason not to enable it. How annoying can it be when a tab starts playing audio unexpectedly? Chrome tabs show a little speaker icon when they're playing sound. With the Tab Audio Muting UI Control enabled, you can simply click on that speaker icon to mute the tab instantly. It's a small change, but it saves you an extra click and adds a bit of convenience to your browsing experience. Moving on, we have Tab Scrolling, a feature that's a lifesaver for those of us who tend to keep many tabs open. With Tab Scrolling, you can choose settings that prevent your tabs from shrinking into oblivion as you open more and more of them. Instead, your tabs will overflow and become scrollable sideways. This means no more squinting to read tiny tab titles or accidentally closing the wrong tab. There are several options to customize this feature. You can set the minimum tab size to medium or large or opt for tabs that never shrink and are always scrollable. It's all about finding the right balance for your browsing habits. If you've been using Chrome for a while, you might have noticed a significant redesign in 2023. If you prefer Chrome's old look, you're in luck. There's a flag called Chrome Refresh 2023 that you can disable to revert to the old design, for now at least. Keep in mind that they might remove this option in the future, but if you're attached to the previous design, you'll want to check this out. Next, we have a game changer feature for those who love to keep multiple tabs open. Hover card images, we all know how cluttered and confusing it can get when you have a bunch of tabs open. It's hard to remember what's on each page, right? Well, here's a neat trick to make your life easier. Head over to your Chrome Flags page, and in the search bar, type Hover. This will bring up an option called Tab Hover Card Images. To enable this feature, click Default, select Enable, and then relaunch your browser. At first glance, nothing has changed, but now, when you hover over each tab, you'll get a little preview of what's on that page. This is incredibly useful, especially when you have loads of tabs open and need a quick way to identify them. Moving on, we have Chrome Labs, a flag that can give you more control over experimental features in Chrome. The Chrome team often tests new features by enabling them on random browsers, and you might not even realize it's happening. If you enable the Chrome Labs flag, you might notice a beaker icon at the top right of your browser. This icon is more commonly seen in the beta version of Chrome, but it's not guaranteed to show up in the regular version. However, you can toggle certain features on and off if you see the beaker icon. This is super useful if you notice something has changed in your browser and you're trying to figure out why. It could be one of these experimental features, and with Chrome Labs, you can turn it off or on as you please. Have you ever been frustrated by the delay when you hit the back or forward button in your browser? Well, 
This flag is here to change that. Enabling the back forward cache flag will cause Google Chrome to start saving entire websites in the cache. The pages will load instantly without waiting when you use the back or forward key to navigate. It's a simple change that can make your browsing experience much smoother and more efficient. If you're tired of waiting for pages to reload every time you navigate back or forward, try the back forward cache. And that's a wrap on of hidden Google Chrome settings. I hope you discovered some new tricks to supercharge your browsing experience. If you found this video helpful, remember to smash that like button and subscribe to TechGroup for more tech insights and tips. Want to stay ahead of the curve? Subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss our update.